The biggest mistake that people can make when treating their acid reflux is not understanding the actual root cause. I just turned 50, and for years I was on and off just about every brand of PPI and antacid you can imagine. But recently, I was able to solve my heartburn and indigestion issues by discovering that my fundamental understanding of acid reflux was completely wrong. You see, much to my surprise, acid reflux is not caused by too much stomach acid. We all have something called a lower esophageal sphincter. It's a muscular valve that guards the connection between your esophagus and your stomach. Whenever we eat, this valve relaxes and opens to let food enter your stomach. In the presence of food, your stomach cells secrete acid. And when your stomach has produced enough acid, it gives a signal back to that valve to shut tight. However, if the acid in your stomach is too low, that signal to the valve becomes weak and it fails to close completely. This is the reason why the contents of your stomach can reflux back up into your esophagus and cause that uncomfortable sensation we call heartburn. In a recent study that tested individuals who suffered from acid reflux, upwards of 90% of the subjects had inadequate acid production. Yet we continue to prescribe proton pump inhibitors that suppress acid production. What sense does that make? To solve acid reflux, we need to raise stomach acidity levels, not lower them. Doing so promotes the healthy digestion of our food, and it gives the proper signal to our esophageal sphincter to close during digestion. Would you believe it's that simple? It is.